Have you got any advice for 21 year olds who I guess seem pretty lost and they don't really know which direction to go in? What would you offer to those guys in terms of advice? Oh, I've got loads of pieces of advice. Loads. Uh, if you don't know what to do, don't go to university. Yeah. That's the first thing. If you know what you want to do and you need a university degree to do it, then obviously pursue that. If you don't know what you want to do, going to university is going to burn three or four years of your time and likely get you into a bunch of debt and a bunch of trouble that you don't need. Um, if you don't know what you're doing, avoid university. Uh, step number one. Two, um, young men who are lost. What can I say? Don't uh, waste... Yeah, don't waste time. Yeah, don't waste time on on frivolous pr pursuits. Stop trying to live like the man unless you've actually become the man first. And that means women. Stop trying to get laid all the time and get beautiful women. Because if you are a nobody, the time and effort it's going to take into convincing a really beautiful woman to go to bed with you is much less time than it would take me or Mike. Because we are a somebody already. So you're burning your hours. Uh, yeah, don't chase women too much. Don't chase having fun too much. Don't chase clout too much. Don't try to be seen in cool places that you can't actually afford to be in. You know, Dubai is actually a very interesting example of this. I'm going to go off on a bit of a tangent here, but that, that's all good advice. It's simple. Dubai is a very good example of this because Dubai is a place where people can look like they're doing something big when they're doing absolutely nothing at all. Mm -hmm. There are hotels in Dubai, like the hotels I stay at, that are one, two, three grand a day, 10 grand a day. They do exist. And there are also hotels in Dubai up near the old town where, you know, the laborers and the workers stay, that costs $35, $40, $50 $50 a day. That, that does happen. You could fly to Dubai, and people do this. Men do this with no money because men don't have the, the ability to just, you know, hit dating apps in Dubai and live the good life. They come to Dubai uh, with their friends. They have no money in their pockets. They have a nice shirt that they'll wear, fine. And they'll take a taxi from their really cheap hotel down to downtown, picture in front of the Burj Khalifa, click, Picture in front of a Lamborghini, click. Now they're a guy with a picture in front of a Lamborghini in Dubai. They're a guy who hangs out in Dubai now. He's at the Burj Khalifa. He makes less than $1,000 a month, probably. You know, people do this. <laughs> mm. They literally clout chase based on location. And that is the biggest waste of time that I've ever heard of. You know, go, yeah. on a, go on a vacation within your budget and have fun with your friends, by all means, and take your mind off trying to be somebody. But yeah, people pretend too hard today. And the, the effort it takes to pretend short term will make you look richer or cooler or more successful than you are. But if you take all the time that you spend pretending and actually invest it into trying to become what you're pretending to be, you'll get there. Yeah. But it will take, again, three, four, five years and people don't want to do it.